Hi there, welcome to this video. My name is Robert Stacey. I'm a BIM Applications Engineer for Mana Machine. And in this video, we're going to be taking a further look at the Mana Machine Building Suite and more specifically, these two filter panels here on the Mana Machine Selection tab. Now, what these two panels enable us to do is to control the visibility and also the selection of objects really quickly and really easily. So let's imagine we wanted to make some selections here on this floor plan. I've got some architectural rooms in here and if we wanted to pick up all of the rooms uh, the conventional way what we would have to do is the only real way is to select everything on the floor plan here by putting a window around everything and then filter the selection down using the selection filter and filter that selection down to just the rooms and then press OK and you can see now I'm just left with all of the rooms and if I wanted to select all of the walls or all of the doors and windows the process would be very much the same now what's great about these filters here is using the uh, configure tool in the top left I can create any filter that I want and the filter is going to be added to this filter drop down here. So now what I can do is simply choose a filter from the list and that selection is going to be made simply at the click of a button. So you can see I've instantly picked up uh, all of the rooms there. I can do the same thing with all of the walls and we can also combine objects together to pick up all of the doors and windows you can see how quick it is to do that and also what's great about these filters is we can also combine the filters together with intelligent rules to make more specific selections so now I can pick up just the internal walls or just the external walls or even uh, all of the rooms with an area greater of 10 meters squared okay what's more is we can also uh, with it, any of the filters that we make we've got the option to make them into a visibility filter which enables us to uh, control the visibility of those elements so let's imagine we wanted to turn off all of the walls on this floor plan the conventional way to do that we would go into the visibility graphics here on the left hand side which would take us to effectively all of the layers inside of Revit we'd scroll down to the walls uh, we would untick the visibility here and then press OK and you can see all of the walls have been switched off and to turn them back on again we'd have to go back into the visibility graphics scroll back down and then tick the, the box for walls again and then press OK what's great about these visibility filters though is now we can just choose a filter from this panel uh, let's go with the walls one again and the visibility is simply going to be toggled off at the click of a button and if I wanted to toggle the visibility back on I'd simply choose walls again and they're going to be turned back on again. So as you can see there's a lot, uh, lot less steps involved with that and the whole pro process is a lot more fluid. So that's been the visibility filter panels here in the Mana Machine building suite. Please like and share this video and if you've got any questions and comments please feel free to leave them in the comment section below and I'll see you in the next video.